Hi guys, my name is K. Pooja Dipti. I am studying Information Technology in SESI Engineering College. Now I am going to explain the 8 Queens problems in ADA. In 8 Queens problem, we have, we have to follow the 3 rules. The 3 rules are, the node 2 Queens are in the same row. That means, if we take, if we take 2 into 2 Queens problem. Here we are going to take four boxes. Suppose we we have to only write the queen one in first row only, and queen two in second row only. Suppose we are placing the first queen in the this box. Uh, we are, have three rules. What are the three rules? No two queens are in the same row. That means we do not place the queen two in this box and second rule is no two queens are in the same column that means we are not going to place the queen two in this place and the third one is what no two queens are arranged in diagonal and that means we not going to place that queen two in this box also so there is no solution for this one two into two and we have to we have to place this queen one in in this box and we have to draw the box again q1 now we are checking again the three rules what are the three rules thus this box cannot be right queen 2 this box cannot be right queen 2 this box also cannot be right queen 2 so there is no solution for the 2 into 2 queens and we are also checking now for 3 into 3 suppose we are going to place the queen 1 in first row No, we, we have to follow the rules. We are not going to place the queen 2 in these two boxes and these two boxes and these two diagonal boxes. And we have only two places left. This place and this place. So we have to write queen 2 only in second row. So we do not place the queen 2 in this box. So we have to place queen 2 in this box. Now we are applying again applying the three rules. What are the three rules? This box we cannot be placed at queen 3. This box also we cannot place queen 3. And these two boxes also these two boxes. So we are not getting place to place the queen 3. So there is no solution. And we have to backtrack the queen 1. Or queen 2 anything. Now we are going to place queen 1 in this box. Now we are going not going to place the queen 2 in these two boxes and these two boxes, this box and this box. So no, now we are not getting the place for all queen 2 only. So there is no solution. And now we have to backtrack the queen 2. So queen 1 is placed in this place only, these two boxes and these two boxes, these two boxes are not placed. And we have only one place left for the queen 2. So there is no backtracking way for queen 2. So for 3 into 3, there is no solution for placing the 3 queens. And we have to check for the 4 into 4 and 8 into 8. Now I am going to explain the 8 into 8 queens problem. we have to we know that already we have to place the queen one in first row only not we are going to not place the queen two in first row and we have to place queen two in second row only also we have to place queen three in third row we have to place queen four in fourth row likewise we have to place all the queens in respect to rows only we cannot place the queen five in fourth row queen three in first row queen two in eighth row that like we cannot place the queens in 8 queens problem we have 8 queens that means we have to place all the 8 queens on 8 into 8 chessboard that is 64 boxes like this we have to draw the box and we have to place all the queens in the these boxes only now we are going to explain the queens problem see that 8 queens problem we have to draw the 8 into 8 chessboard like in chessboard we know that queen can only move in the row wise column wise in diagonal wise only so using that formula we have to place the queens
now we have 18 to 8 chess boxes and 1 2 3 5 4 6 7 8 8 rows and 8 columns okay now we are going to place the queens according to the these three rows the, what are the three rows we cannot place the same queen in the same row and same column and diagonal wise queen one is placed in only in the first row so i am going to place the queen one in this first row now we are not going to place the another queens in these boxes and these boxes and diagonal wise boxes okay now we am going to place the queen to in second row only now i am going to place this queen to in these boxes now we are not going to place the any queen in these boxes and diagonal wise boxes this and diagonal wise boxes now i am going to place the queen tree here and i am not going to place the another queens in diagonal wise boxes and these boxes queen 4 likewise i am placing all the queens and the queen 4 here and one we are not going to place the any row queen in the row or same column and queen 5 i am placing here and the queen 6 i am placing here queen 7 i am placing here queen 8 i am placing here so we are checking the rules for the all the queens now queen 1 is placed here any queen is placed in diagonal here no there is no queen in the diagonal there is any queen in the same row or same column no there is no same now we are checking for the queen 2 there is no queen diagonal wise and row wise and column wise so queen 2 and queen 3 1 are seated and we are checking for queen 3 there is no queen in the same row or same column and diagonal wise so queen 3 also settled and we are checking for the queen 4 and there is no queen in the same row or same column so queen 4 is also settled and we are checking for the queen 5 there is no queen in the same row and same column so queen 5 also settled so now we check for the queen 6 no there is no queen in the same row diagonal and the same column so this is also now checking for queen 7 there is no queens uh, uh, violate in the three rules queen 8 also uh, okay now we are writing the solution vector for these so queens what are the solution vector for these queens solution vector is we have to arrange like an array 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 ok queen 1 queen 2 queen 3 queen 4 queen 5 queen 6 queen 7 queen 8 we are going to write the column numbers because we know that old row can queen 1 can be placed in only the first row queen 2 can be placed in the first so we are writing the columns first queen placed in the which column fourth column second queen placed in the sixth column queen 3 placed in the eighth column queen 4 placed in the second column queen 5 placed in the first column Q6 no sorry Q7 Q5 placed in the seventh column Q6 placed in the first column Q7 placed in the third column Q8 is placed in the fifth column and this is the solution vector for the 8 into 8 queens problem okay so there are two types of constraints in the n queens problem or 8 queens problem what are the two constraints one is the explicit constraint and the second one is the implicit constraint explicit constraints we have to write the solution vector and this is the formula for the solution vector i belongs to i is the number of queens means how many queens are there here there are n eight queens so which column first queen to eight queens we have to arrange in the columns i is the column number and one to eight is the queens implicit constraints means this is the solution vector for this implicit constraints we are saying we have the probabilities for placing the queens what are the probabilities uh, total number of probability for placing a queen in 18 to 8 chess board is 64 c8 after applying the these two constraints means we are taking the rows because rows means we have to arrange we know that uh, we have to arrange queen one into first row only so we are taking that uh, rule outside and after applying these two constants the possible ways are 8 factorial ways 
the applications of nquin problems is parallel it is used for parallel memory storage schemes and it is used for vlsi testing and it is used for traffic controls and it is used for deadlock prevention and what is the use of N nquin's problem is it is used to increase your brain power and uh, and this is about the eight queens problem thank you guys